Oh hey, it's me. Welcome to another video. Today I'm doing Today I'm doing something that's kind of weird for me to do and different and I'm kind of scared to do it and I don't know if I'll upload this video. <laughs> but I'm going to be doing a clothing haul, which is so not something I would usually do. But I brought a bunch of clothes online and I asked you guys on Twitter if you want me to do like a video on it and a lot of you guys seem to be very interested to see what my style is like, so I'm gonna do it. I shop on AliExpress a lot because I hate going out and shopping for clothes. I hate trying stuff on and I can just never find anything that I actually like or actually suits me. So I usually prefer to buy stuff online because there's more options. This isn't a sponsored video or anything like that. I'm not being sent these, I'm not being paid or anything like that. So yeah, I just wanted to get clothes because... I need new clothes because I'm going to Japan in like less than a month, like three, almost two weeks. So I've got some things that I haven't opened and I've also got like old things that I've had for a while. I just thought I would show you guys like pretty much almost everything that I have from AliExpress clothing wise. Also it's like a very hot day today in New Zealand because it's summer for us and I'm sweating my ass off. I'm sorry I look disgusting and my hair is disgusting. So I have some things, some like warm clothes for Japan because it'll be winter in Japan. And also I have some like cooler things since it's summer for me. So um, I'll start with this because I've already opened it sort of that I haven't worn. It already has dog hair on it though. So this is a pink hoodie. By first already looking at it, it already looks a bit brighter than the actual picture. But it's not just a plain pink hoodie. It's got hearts on the sleeve. Isn't that cute? The first picture of this listing, it definitely looks more of a pastel pink which I kind of would have preferred because I don't really like very bright pink but I mean it's still pretty cute I'll probably still wear it although I just noticed it has heaps of like can you see like all these little white bits they're actually rips in the fabric they're little small like uh, rips like the strings coming out which I didn't notice before but um that really sucks there's heaps of them probably too late for me to get a refund on this because um, I've had it for a few weeks now. Excuse me! Okay, oh my god, it's way too hot to wear this. No, no, Toby! So it is pretty warm, it's pretty thick. You can see the hearts on my sleeves here. Apart from the rips, um, I mean, you can't really notice it like far away. Like, it kind of just looks like white stains. Yeah, I think it's pretty good. I probably will still bring this to Japan because it's quite warm. So you guys know, I will have links to everything in the description. I think this was about 20 New Zealand dollars. Maybe it was like 18. So that's like probably like 10, 15 US dollars. So I mean, it was very cheap. So it, of course, it's not going to be amazing quality for that price. Okay, so I haven't looked at this one yet, but I do know what it is. Oh, yes. Oh my God. It's such a nice color. Oh, I forgot to mention. Sorry, I'm like really new to this stuff. So I'm sorry if I'm doing a horrible job at at this but um uh this is a size xxl <laughs> honestly it isn't very big for being an xxl because i'm usually a size small but when i buy stuff from aliexpress usually i get it in medium um but with hoodies i get large or extra large or the biggest size i can get because i really love big sick hoodies for being an xxl this is very small this is like this is like a medium i would say new zealand size but it's apparently an XXL. This shirt that's not from America, it's from a New Zealand store. It's like an extra small men's shirt and it's pretty baggy, so yeah. Okay, so let's open this shirt. Look at it. This is, I love this pink. This is a, this is a good pink. <laughs> kind of weird for me to say because I'm not really a girly person and I used to hate the color pink, but now I really like pastel colors. I think they're really cute. This is a medium, by the way, and it looks like a pretty, pretty good medium okay so this is like a perfect size for me since i'm usually a small usually if i go for small in aliexpress it's way too tight for me but this is pretty good for a uh, for a medium and it's really cute i really wanted to get some different colored shirts because pretty much all my shirts are either white or black also the picture in here is like that shiny kind of stuff so hopefully it won't come off easily it doesn't feel like it would it feels like really good quality an AliExpress shirt. So I'm quite happy with this. Um, I'll let you guys know if this picture comes off in the wash or something, but I don't think it will. It seems like it's pretty, pretty stuck on there, you know? Okay, so these are two skirts. I've already tried them on, so I'm not going to put them on for this video because they're kind of, they're too short anyway, and I don't really want to show everything. And it looks like, it looks like a pretty good length here, but the thing is, it's one of the high waist skirts, so and actually, you have to pull it up to like here. So it's like this short and like, 
I don't know about you, but for me personally, I don't really like having a skirt too short. They both do have built-in shorts, but the shorts, they're really short. So they're not even like long enough to be short. They're pretty much like wearing another pair of underwear. And also they're very see-through, so they're kind of pointless and you kind of have to wear like another pair of shorts over them. So you're pretty much wearing like three layers. So yeah, I mean, they seem like they're really good quality and they're really cute, but unfortunately for me personally, they're too short, but I will leave the links below anyway if you're interested in them. I think these are about $12 each. So yeah, they're so cute though. It's a shame they're like really, really short. For these, for these kind of like, for skirts, it's kind of better to buy them like in the store because then you can try them on and make sure they're the right size for you. But I do want to show you guys a skirt that I've had for about a year and a half from AliExpress. Okay, it is covered in dog hair. You probably can't see it, so that's good. But it's this one and I love this skirt so much. I've had it for so long. It also does have built-in shorts too, but again, they're, they're pretty much like underwear because they're so short so I wear another pair of shorts over top of them <laughs> yeah these uh, I think this is a size medium too and this one's like a pretty good length it is getting a bit too short for me because I'm a growing young lady but I did actually order another one of these in white which hasn't arrived yet it's like a very strange fabric but it's pretty comfy and it, it's like thin but it's not like too thin that you can see through it's like just a nice thin one for summer and I think it was about ten dollars by the way I say everything in New Zealand dollars so like if you live in like US, I think just half it and they'll be US dollars. Okay, this is another thing I haven't tried on yet. So this is like a knitted uh, sweater. I got this in extra large by the way because I like my big sweaters. Okay, oh my god. Oh, it smells... It smells like dirty socks. It's just kind of like a basic sweater but it does have these really cute blossom designs on the sleeves, like cherry blossoms, which I thought were really cute. It definitely smells awful, so I'll probably put it in the wash and hopefully that will get rid of the smell. Oh so yeah, it's really comfy. It is very big. You can't even see my shorts. It's not like very thick, but it's like something I would wear like under a jacket or something. I think it was about 18 New Zealand dollars. I feel a little bit itchy. Hopefully I'll get used to that or something. And also it does stink, hopefully. I'll get rid of that smell because it's awful. Oh yeah, this was something I ordered recently that I already opened because I loved it so much. This is just like a white t-shirt with this like anime kind of vaporwave like design on it. I've actually ordered this twice because the first time I ordered it, I accidentally fell over and spilled spaghetti all over it. And I was very sad and I liked it so much that I ordered it again. It was about $10 I think, which is very good considering it like the quality feels so nice. I don't know how to explain this to you guys. It's really soft and it... It almost feels like swimsuit material, but in a good way because it's like just really soft and like silky feeling. Also, the, the first time I ordered it, the picture was like, like down here, which I was kind of like annoyed about. But the second time I ordered it, it was in the right place. So, yeah. Um, this is a medium and it's a pretty good size on me. It's probably about the same as this t-shirt. So, I don't think you guys need to see me with it on. What are you doing, Toby? These are some socks that I haven't opened yet. This is my first time ordering socks with AliExpress, so hopefully they'll fit. So I found these really adorable little socks. There's heaps of different designs, and I said to get these really cute strawberry um, designs. They are so cute. There's other ones too. There's like peaches and watermelons, I think, too. They're so adorable. I think they're they're really cheap. I think they're about three dollars. Not gonna show you guys my foot because um, I don't want to be in a foot fetish websites. But thanks anyway. And they fit perfectly. I think there's only one size. So I don't know how sock sizing work, but I'm usually the smallest size. <laughs> okay. So these two are kind of weird. Mouth masks. Face mask. Mouth face mask. I don't know. You'll see. Oh my god, I'm so kawaii. So, I got these just because they're kind of cute and like cute for cosplay and stuff. And because I always get sick whenever I travel. And I know in Japan and other Asian countries, if you're sick, you should wear a face mask so other people don't get sick. Which I think is really cool and I think every country should do that. Because I get sick so easily from like going out. So I'm really hoping I don't get sick while I'm in Japan. But I got this anyway. And also just because it's it's cute and it was only like less than a dollar. And also it's a nice thing to keep your face warm too. And I have another one here. This one is a beer one. Oh my god, it's so cute. Are we still here? Just to suffer. Um, I think these are both like less than a dollar. 
Um, they have heaps of other designs too, so they're in the description. Oh, this is a shirt that I got a long time ago. I thought I would show it anyway because I kind of wear it quite a lot. Um, it's just like some random anime design and I just thought it was cool and cute. Um, this was really cheap. I think this was like literally $5. It, I think it's more expensive now. I think I got it on sale. And I think this is a size small so it is quite tight on me. But it's really cute and I really like it. Um, I hope this isn't like stolen art or anything because places like AliExpress and Wish tend to steal other people's art. So if it is, if there's an original artist and anyone knows, please let me know so I can give credit to them in the description or something. Um, this is also one I got um, a couple of years ago. This was actually a Christmas gift to me. I thought it was short anyway because it is from AliExpress. Just like a little Totoro. Um, shirt. Um, again, this one kind of looks like it might be stolen art. Let me know. Don't get mad at me. I didn't buy this and like, I'm sorry. Since I didn't buy this myself, it might be hard to find. So if it's not in the description, I'm sorry. But I really like the fabric of this. This is like really nice to wear on a summer's day because it's kind of like, I don't know how to explain it. It's kind of like you're wearing a gym shirt, you know? In school and like the PE uniform how it's like it's good for like the breeze going through kind of feels like that I don't know how to explain it but yeah it feels like that oh yeah this is a bag I got from Aliexpress well it's just like a little kind of like purse bag it fits like your phone in it if you have a small wallet maybe a wallet too maybe just some cash um it's just good for like when you're going for a walk you know probably about 10 15 dollars um so here is the one I've had for a while this is really cute it's just like a cute little hoodie with this like design on it that says evil cutie got like a satanic bunny on it i really like this hoodie but it was very expensive it was like 50 dollars when i bought it you can find it for cheaper now but um that's a lot because it's like really not very high quality it's the kind of material that gets like like bitty bid stuck to it is that what everyone calls it in other countries because in my country we call them bitty bid it's just like a little fluff like when you put it in the wash it just gets fluff stuck to it and it's like so annoying to get off which kind of sucks and it makes it look a bit dirty i might try and get all this like all this um fluff off it and maybe i'll bring it to japan because it's cute it also has these like weird things here and you had to like tie them yourself when you got it it's, it's kind of weird but it's also kind of cool and it's also kind of uncomfortable. You can also take it off and just have like no sleeves if you want. Also, when I first got it, I noticed there's like a little like rip in it. And I have no idea if it came like that or if I did that by accident. But like you can't really notice it when it's on. So I don't really care. Also, it's very long. I think this is a medium or maybe it's a large. I'm not sure. But it's supposed to be pretty long. There's also a black version of it too, which also looks pretty cool. Okay, I think this will be the last thing I'll show you guys. Um, this is also a thing I got a, quite a long time ago. Oh, this is an Overwatch Diva hoodie. Um, I brought it because I cosplayed as Diva um, for a convention like two years ago. I, I cosplayed as like casual Diva, so I wanted to wear like a cool like hoodie for it. This is really cute. I absolutely love this hoodie. It is so warm as well. Like it's really thick material. Here's the hood. It's got a little diva bunny on it. I don't know if like this design is stolen from like an artist or something. If anyone knows, let me know. Because there's so many people who sell it on AliExpress and also Wish and eBay. So it's hard to know if it's stolen or not. I think this was about $45, $50 when I bought it. But I'm pretty sure you can find it for like $30, $35. I don't have the exact listing of this jacket anymore. But I'll try and find one. Most of the time when I use AliExpress, it's pretty good. I usually get what I order. There's been some times where I don't get it at all but usually they'll give you a refund if you don't receive it or if it's damaged or the wrong thing they'll refund you like the refund's really good on aliexpress most things i order on there are usually really good there's been one time where i ordered something and i literally threw it out because it was so bad it was like a blue hoodie with bunny ears on the hood and like a little bunny picture over here and the quality was so garbage. I ordered an extra large and it was so tiny. And the quality was just so bad. It was so thin and it looks completely different from the picture. So I literally threw it in the trash. It was like 15 bucks or something. But still like... Jesus, man. So yeah, if you want to buy any of the stuff that I showed in this video, I have all the links down below. Um, again, I brought all the stuff with my own money. I didn't get Santa or anything. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you want me to do more of these... Um, let me know. I probably won't anytime soon because I don't usually buy a lot of clothes in one one time. But I don't know. I do want to buy some clothes while I'm in Japan. So maybe I'll do a clothing Japan haul when I'm back. But also knowing me, I'll probably spend all my money on anime figures. Anyways guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!